Hi, good afternoon. It's Simon at Vans today in Worcester. I'm going to give you a quick video walk around of this 2018 on a 68. It is the legendary Toyota Hilux single cab pickup with the 2.4 D4D engine. It is the Euro 6 emission zone compliant model as well. Um, nice bits of additional specification, including that Truckman color coded hard top. You have your LED. Uh, warning light on top of that we have a tow pack fitted to it as well load liner um, obviously as standard it comes with electric windows mirrors auto lights air conditioning etc um, dab no sorry not dab it's got fm am uh, but it does have bluetooth telephone and bluetooth music now this vehicle is in great all-round condition obviously as you know the hiluxes they're either in good nick or they've been completely abused uh, just start up here on the roof. The roof's in good condition, as is the nose cone on the hard top. Looking at, we just have a couple of little minor little chips that will just touch up slightly on the edge of the roof. We'll T cut and touch those up for you. But the uh, windscreen, as you can see, is in good order with no cracks or major stone chipping on it. Coming down onto your bonnet, the bonnet is in good overall condition. Again, no major stone chipping or damage to point out to you front of the vehicle your front grills front of the front bumper number plates etc in good overall condition we do have a minor mark on the plastics here and just down to here so a couple of little minor marks there but as you can see here i am stood about two meters away it's not a standout item at all coming around to the passenger side passenger side light unit is in good order passenger side front bumper corner is in good order with no scuffing Looking down the side profile of the vehicle from this angle, hopefully you can see no major damage to point out to you. It's a really, really straight and tidy vehicle, this one, I have to say. Coming around to finish off the front end, your driver's side headlamp unit, that's all in good order. Then your driver's side front bumper corner, again, in overall good condition. If we're being really fussy, there's just an ever so slight scratch there on the black plastic bumper. Again, looking down the side profile of the vehicle, Really straight and tidy, No, uh, nothing really to cosmetically point out to you, but let's do it by panel by panel. We show it warts and all. Passenger front wing, side repeater is where it should be. On the uh, front here, we have a factory steel wheel with a general grabber all-terrain tyre fitted to it. That tyre has loads of tyre tread depth, hopefully you can see there. Just having a quick look under here as well, it's not full of mud. Um, you know, nothing excessively abused under there or anything. Uh, driver's side mirror unit and the mirror itself's in good order. Driver's side door glass, that's in good order. Driver's side door itself, that's in nice condition as well. So the front tub, etc., that's all in really nice condition. Coming to the rear of the vehicle, your rear tub. Let's just give you a overview of the external part of the vehicle from this angle. As you can see, it looks very, very presentable, doesn't it? Um, your rear tub on this side is in good order with no major cosmetics to point out to you. Your hard top on this side, again, truckman item, and that's in good order as well. As you can see, it has an overbed liner that the truckman is mounted on top to. Steel wheel, factory steel wheel this side, small element of corrosion on your steel wheel. We have a uh, Yokohama Geolander tyre on this tyre, and that has plenty of tyre tread depth on there for you as well. Again, just having a quick look under the arches, all looking very presentable under there as well. And looking at your seals from this angle, no damage to your seals underneath the vehicle. We have front and rear mud flaps fitted to it. Just another viewpoint down the side of the vehicle from this angle, all very good. Rear bumper, a couple of marks on the rear bumper, okay? A couple of little dings on the rear bumper, really common on the Hiluxes, there's no parking sensors. Uh, your rear bumper is a bit of a parking sensor. You've got a bit of a ding there on the rear bumper. Light unit's good. Back end of the vehicle. Again, as I say, high level uh, warning light on the top of it. Uh, lockable truckman hardtop. Your tailgate is in good order as well. We have a tow pack fitted to it as well with single electrics. Ding on your rear bumper on this side as well. But have a look at your plastics on top of the bumper. Those are in good order with no major damage on them. Hard top. Just twist that to open, pull these handles out such as that, fold it down and there is the rear of the vehicle. So your hard top is in good order throughout inside, 
As you can see, the load liner as well, really good condition, doesn't appear to have done anything major from a work point of view. And we have the load liner that goes over your back of your tailgate as well. One of the key points to notice on these Hiluxes, so although there are marks here, it's not completely battered, scratched, gone rusty and all of that. So it shows that it's not really had a hard life, this one at all. Again, to close it, just to move those two levers back in, closes it nicely for you. And there we go. Uh, we have a little bit of a chip on the corner of the rear light there. And then looking down the passenger side of the vehicle, the hard top again, good order, and the passenger side of the vehicle is in good order. Your passenger side rear light unit's all good. Hard top itself, good condition. The rear tub on this side, again, all in very nice, tidy condition. Again, your steel wheel on the rear on this side has elements of corrosion on it. There has Yokohama Geolander tyres, so that matches your axle on the other side. I suggest they were replaced at around the same time because they appear to have pretty similar tyre tread depth. Arches again, clean and tidy as is the chassis wells. Looking down the bottom of the vehicle here, there's no damage to the sills. Fuel flap uh, oh, opens inside actually, to be fair. And then passenger side window and door, again, good order. Alignment of your doors are all as they should. We have just a few, so this is a um, paint film protection cover that the factory puts on from new. It's a little bit manky there to be fair, as you can see. That's just a little bit of excess glue or something on it. Mirror's all good. And then your passenger side front wing, that's all looking good as well. We have a steel wheel on the front here, factory steel wheel with a general grabber. Uh, AT3 tyre as well. We could do with a bit of air in that tyre to be quite frank with you, so we'll get that checked out for you. But again, looking at your arches, there's no excessive wear or tear on those. And externally, as I say, really, really tidy condition. So having a quick look in the front cab, which is in equally as good condition. Your door cards are in very tidy condition. Nice and clean inside as well. Look at your entry sills and the plastic protection uh, seals here. So they're in really good condition. Normally these wear through on the Hilux. So really good, clean, tidy condition. Door shuts are really tidy as well. Headlining, etc. all good. We have, let's just move. So well, hang on a second. So flooring we have rubber mats on the flooring okay let's move the camera down there out of the way move the price board and the spare rear number plate out of the way and then you can see your passenger seat trim which again is in very clean tidy condition let's go around to the passenger side i'm not going to open up the bonnet today i have photographed it so refer yourself to the uh, website for the photos of underneath the bonnet but again clean and tidy under there as well and then your driver's door card again, all pretty good as well on this side. Entry sill, so a little bit of wear here. We normally put a bit of wear tape down there. It's where you hit it every time getting in and out. But plastic protection seals are all good. Rubber mats are good. And then your driver's side seat, that is in good condition as well. We have electric windows and electric mirrors. We have your power heat and your headlamp levelers here. We have your fuel flap release on the right and your bonnet release on the left. The um, vents, etc., those are in good order. And top of the dashboard, that's in really nice, tidy condition as well. Steering wheel, no excessive wear on the steering wheel. We've got a bit of multi-function capacity on this side for your volume. Uh, voice activation and Bluetooth telephone settings, answer, etc. On that side, we have auto lights and rear fog light on that side, and we have wipers on that side. If I just get into the vehicle now, fire it up, you need your former clutch to fire it up, it'll do a systems check on the vehicle. I think we're low on AdBlue at the moment, which is telling me that my AdBlue level is low. So obviously that comes under our pre-delivery inspection content and we'll get that topped up for you as well. As I say, FM, AM, stereo with Bluetooth telephone and Bluetooth music. We have the all important air conditioning down here as well. Electronic stability program and your rear diff lock here as well. 
selectable four wheel drive system here, six speed manual gearbox, eco mode, power mode, that's for your warning light on the roof, cup holders are clean, down the sides of the seats hopefully you can see, clean and tidy, no old McDonald's or anything down there inside, your armrest is all good. And overall, I would suggest it's a very clean and tidy Hilux. So it's a one keeper from new vehicle with a warranted 56,000 miles, uh, very clean and tidy. There are 50 to 60 photos of this vehicle on our website. Our website is vanstoday.com and we are Vans Today Worcester based in the center of the country, offering you nationwide delivery, part exchange and finance. Feel free to give us a call on 01905 672 080 or email us at sales at vanstoday.com. Uh, if you're worried about who you're buying off, check out our reputation online. We have nothing to hide. We are on Google. We have reviews on our own website. We have reviews on Facebook. We are on Instagram, LinkedIn, etc. etc. Um, thank you very much for looking at the video. It's about 12 minutes of your life. You're never going to get back. But if you are interested, a lot of our customers nowadays will buy the vehicle after watching this video and either have it delivered to them or come and collect it. Um, there we go. Thanks very much. Cheers.